Even in the Batcave. Holy chill blades. Look at the Bat computer, Batman. I am. Oh, chill, I am. Frozen to its very marrow. How? Why? No doubt, Mr. Freeze, up to another diabolical thermodynamic experiment at the risk of sending cold shivers down your backside. Mrs. Cooper has just heard a most chilling morning broadcast. Say no more, Alfred. Yes, Batman. Arrange a broadcast to Mr. Freeze, Commissioner. Tell him, tell him we await his demands whenever they are. In the meantime, is that seal still in the bathtub in police headquarters? Yeah, flipping merrily away. Good. You have a seal, that signal I gave you? The small, echoing seal pulsator? Uh, yes, Batman, it's right here. Excellent. Attach it to one of the seal's flippers, then release the seal in Gotham Harbor. No doubt it will home for Mr. Freeze's iceberg, and we'll pick up its wavelength in the Batcopter. Right, Batman. Pick up the seal pulsator yet, Batman? We're still over land, Robin, and a seal is an aquatic marine mammal. Gosh, yes, Batman, I forgot. Signal. This only seems to be heading through Gotham Narrows. Meanwhile, in his refrigerated refuge, Mr. Freeze and his frosty flunkies work out our demands. Can you think of anything else? The, the, the part I like, boss, is that complete guarantee of immunity. The part I like is all that ice like in diamonds. Fifty million dollars is not to be sneezed at. Of course, I never catch cold. Aren't you skating on thin ice? How do you expect payment to be made? By Batman and Robin, of course. Now, oh, Frosty, you seem to forget. The dynamic duo are now defunct. Oh, that's right. Part of a nice rig. I guess we can call them now the vaporized vanquisher, eh? <laughs> hey, boss? That's not bad, Frosty. Vaporized vanquishers. <laughs> Mr. Freeze, 
thanks to Ingenuity, your homing seal, our ice bat rags, and our ice bat ropes, and our reverse thermal bat lozenges. So you see, Mr. Freeze, you're the one who's on ice. Chakoosh!